Hey guys, welcome to Excel Tutorial Channel again, and we are moving towards the end of financial function and formulas in Excel. So this video is gonna be very special for you if you are from the accounting background because we are going to find profit and profit margin in Excel using custom formulas. So we are going to calculate the gross profit, operating profit, and net profit, and its margin using our formula. And we are going to explain each and every formula in the mathematical expressions also. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do it because we are covering each and every scenarios functionality of Excel in detail. So let's just get started. So here we have a very basic sheet here. We have annual income, cost, expenses, interest and taxes paid. I know this is very vague and this is very, very basic sheet because it doesn't have a long, long values down here. But the idea behind this video is to give get you going through these formulas such that you can understand the basic workaround of the formula we are going to cover. So first part we are going to cover the gross profit margin. So we have a nice little calculator here and we are going to calculate in this blank cells. So we have this explainers board like we have done in our previous videos. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to write down the formula for each of the margin and we are going to calculate on the basis of this mathematical expression to here so in the first we are going to cover the gross profit margin so gross profit how you calculate the gross profit so you usually calculate the gross profit like total income minus cost right cost on goods sold or you can say cost so that's how you calculate your gross profit right but if you want to calculate the margin here gdp margin then you divide this profit with the total income right or we can also say total income minus cost divided by let me just put a dot in brackets of total income right so that's how you calculate the gp margin and mathematical expression so now we are going to use this mathematical expression in our excel calculation so in the same way just open our formula operator here like with this symbol which is a equal to and here we gonna open a bracket because we are going to calculate first the total income minus the cost which is the gross profit so the total income is 300,000 and minus the total cost which we have incurred is 60,000 so profit we know is to 170,000 but we need a pro gross profit margin so this little function or you can see this little formula is your gross profit and now to calculate margin we need to divide that by our total income so let's find out it does give a desired answer or not so yes it gave a 80 percent so this is my formatted cell here so if you get your number like 0 0.80 or something like that then you should you should right click on that cell and click on format cell and there you need to select this percentage option here and just select if you need any decimals if you don't need any decimals then just delete that out to zero and click ok so you will get this nice little format in percentages so hope you understand how to calculate the gross profit margin in excel I know it's pretty much easy right because you have completed these such equation in your accounting subject if you haven't then you should <laughs> do that again I know this is very silly so let's move on to our next topic which is operating profit margin so operating profit is equal to gross profit minus the operating expenses as versus is operating so with the operating as our keyword so we know we need to deduct something related to operation right so we need to deduct gp which is the gross profit minus operating expense here okay let me just type down the whole formula here so opm is equal to gp but i'm not going to just enter the gp here let's just say total income minus cost and now we are going to deduct our operating expenses operating expenses can be anything related to your operations like your rent if you have rented your office then you pay your office rent right then it comes under the operating expense you have a stationary day-to-day -day expenses or you can have a pc installed in your offices so all those 
cost should be incurred in this particular operating expenses so let me just write the minus expenses operating okay so you should just include that in bracket and divide that by our total income here so that's very much related to gross profit right because there we haven't deducted a operating expense now in the operating profit margin you need to deduct the operating expense and divide the whole equation with the total income like we have done in gross profit margin so now let's just apply this mathematical expression to our cell here let's just open our formula operator like this and we have a total income to be entered so total income is this minus cost which is this minus expenses which is 10,000 and just close it down so until the here we have operating profit okay so we will get the operating profit and let's see how much we get we get to 230,000 so now we divide by the total income here to find the operating profit margin so there you go you get the little weird decimal numbers here let me just format that by right clicking on it and go to the format and there you just click on percentages here i don't need a decimal number so i'm just put it to zero here and it just round off to 77 percent so we get the nice little 77 percent of operating profit margin here so hope you understand how to calculate the operating profit margin using this formula and now we are going to the third part of our video which is should be the net profit margin so net profit margin deducts all kind of interests and taxes incurred in your business okay so now we have here the opm which is operating profit margin now the net the total net income you get in your hand after all various expenses then you get your net income so how we calculate the net profit so we calculate net profit all the operating profit minus interest minus taxes all the taxes and interest should be deducted so that's how you get your net profit okay what is op here op is operating profit which we get from the total income minus cost minus this and let's just copy that and paste in the place of op here so here we get the net profit full formula here which is the total income minus the cost on goods sold minus the expenses and minus interest and minus taxes that's how you get your net profit here and to calculate the margin you need to do what yes you need to just divide that by total income again now here's the task for you you just need to apply this formula or you can say mathematical expression in this cell using the same way we have done before in term of operating profit margin you should pause the video now and just do it with yourself and just come back to this video and let's find out if you have done or not okay just pause this video okay so now we are calculating net profit margin so we are opening our formula with the formula operator here like this and here in the first let's just open the bracket because we need that bracket let's just put the net profit formula here total income minus cost minus expenses right and minus interest and minus taxes so that's how you get your net profit until now that was the formula for the net profit let's find out how much we get our profit in hand which is 222,000 and to find the margin here the percentage margin we just need to divide that by total income so that's much how much you get which is 74 percent if you want to format in the percentages just right click click on the format cell and click on the percentages just delete these decimal places and if you wanted you can add so there we go so we get the net profit margin of 74 percent so hope you get to know how to calculate such profit margins in Excel using these little formulas if you have then please click the like button and if you have questions in mind if you want to ask something then don't shy just ask away in our comment box and one of our associate will be in contact with you and if you want to learn such concept more in future 
then please click the subscribe button you will get the videos notification in your inbox so see you in the next video until then bye bye